Well, welcome to another episode of Ask the Scientist. My name is Dr. Jeff Galini, and this show is about busting myths and bringing you the truth. Anyway, uh, several, several people um, since the introduction of Carbolin have asked, can Carbolin be used to carb up before a bodybuilding contest, a physique, a fitness, and what's the best way to use it? So first of all, I'm gonna talk about um, how to do that. So always try this before, you know, anytime that you know you are bodybuilding, you should always try all of your carb loading and your carb depletion um, long before the first time you ever step on stage. So that's my first recommendation. If you haven't used Carbolin, you should give it a try. See how does it affect your body? How does it help you with your pumps and your workout? Now Carbolin comes in essentially two types. You've got neutral and you've got the flavored Carbolin. The flavored Carbolin is great for you know your workouts, your recovery, your during the day. But when you're getting into uh, carb loading for your contest, you want to use the neutral because the neutral doesn't contain any sweeteners, any flavors, uh, citric acid that could blow you, and of course uh, it's sodium free. So very important. Now again, not knowing you know how much water you drink or what all you do, for the most part, you know people will complex carb load several days beforehand when you get to the day of is when you start putting back uh, those simple carbohydrates. So what I would recommend is the night before taking about 50 grams of Carbolin neutral um, in whatever your water source would be for that evening. Um, again, not knowing how much water that you would drink. And then I would take the next dose of Carbolin literally about five, 10 minutes, 15 minutes before I went backstage and I started to pump up. Remember, carbolin is absorbed as quickly as the sugar. So within about five minutes, you know, those glucose levels are spiked. So you should start to see your veins popping out. Um, so again, mix it in uh, what water you would normally sip on back there, 25, 50 grams. It really doesn't matter um, at that point. It depends on how much you can get into your water. And I would just kind of sip, uh, sip on that as I was pumping up. I'd get a little bit in beforehand and then try to get that finished before I went on the stage. And what you should find, or what you will find, you know, in our clinical studies, uh, Carbolin lasted for about 75 minutes. So you should have that glucose out on stage during your entire time, uh, keeping you pumped and full. And I think that's the difference between, you know, drinking sugar, water, uh, honey, you know, dried fruits and things like this that are going to be burned up very quickly. You know, the last thing you want to do is be out on stage and just flatten out and run out of gas. Anyhow, uh, that's my recommendations for how to use Carbolin. Uh, if you want to try it, send me an email. I'll send you out some Carbolin. Uh, let me know if you don't want the flavored, if you'd like to try the neutral, and I'd have to get you some samples put together on that. Other than that, if you got any questions, also send me an email. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, um, all of those areas, and like my page. Take care. We'll see you next time.